40 is one of my favorite songs by U2 and it was written in 1983 for the War album. And believe it or not, I actually just downloaded the MIDI file offline and threw it into GarageBand and um, exists in like two minutes. So this is my little ode to the U2 song 40. It's actually pretty easy to do, and maybe I'll do a quick tutorial and show you how to do it later on. Apparently 40 is the highest number that Big Bird and Elmo can count to. So I finally got artwork up on my page, but I found out that, well, this doesn't look very good. I spent all this time so this is what I learned. I uploaded the channel art here, and it says right down at the bottom, these are the dimensions. So I went into Photoshop and made something that that was the dimensions. So at those dimensions, this is the artwork that I came up with. It was kind of fun to do, you know. I thought this would be great, right? But then I found out the only people that'll be seeing it or the everything in that image will be the people that view it on like Google TV, and not on the mobile and not on the YouTube. So I have to go in and I crop it. So I go in and I try and crop it and adjust the crop. But the crappy thing is, is like, this is the this is the area that they give you, just this stuff that's not highlighted. So I try and move this in, and you know I got little to no space. I can't go outside. I can't do any of this. And so I basically get what you see now. And I'm probably just gonna push cancel, but there's just a small area. So I'm gonna have to go back and redo this. I'm out of time today, but. Yeah, so I learned that was kind of disappointing. So I finally got some time to play with some new lenses that I got in the mail. These were actually pretty cheap. They're, they're kind of a rip off of the Olo Clip. I bought an Olo Clip and I lost it like a few days after and it was like a $70 loss. But I found this and I was like, well, maybe it's just as good. And do you know what? They are. I So um, here's a little, I'll go into more detail. I'll make a little tutorial about the differences and the looks that you get, but I'll just show you some of the things that I found and learned in playing with this lens. One of the good things about this is it doesn't just have to go on the back camera, you can actually put it on the front, and which will help me a lot as I do my blog. So here are some of the differences, and if you wanna know more, I did a full demonstration in a tutorial that will be coming out soon. So this is what it is with, and that's normal. And this is the macro with, and that's your macro normal. So it gets pretty close. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching if you're one of the eight people that actually follow this blog. Remember to like it if this at all was helpful for you. And um, I'll see you tomorrow. I waited patiently for the Lord. He inclined and heard my cry. He lifted me up and up again out of the murray clay. I will sing, sing a new song. I will sing, sing a new song. I will sing, sing a new song. I will sing, sing a new song.